Hey everybody, it's Eric from Varmture.com. First, as always, the warning. This video does contain graphic content, so you have been warned. I went up last week to Northeast California to shoot ground squirrels. I hunted almost exclusively with my contender in the 17 Winchester Super Magnum caliber. And we just had a blast. I mean, we went up there. There was a storm that was blowing in and it was the last day of the storm, so it was, although it was cold and there was snow dropping here and there, um, when we arrived to the area, the blue sky started to show up, the clouds were breaking, the wind was actually dying down as well, because it was very windy. Next morning we woke up to, you know, about 15 degree weather, everything was iced up, uh, but that wasn't a problem because we knew it was going to hit the low 60s that day. This is the typical field in the area that we hunted, there's just thousands of acres of all sorts of uh, you know crops and such mainly alfalfa and our setup was just basically like this it's my buddy Tom hunting where we sit up on the edge of the field and we had ground squirrels in front of us by the hundreds and you think little ground squirrels not a big deal well here's the holes they make this is a five gallon bucket next to just two of the holes that are out there and then lastly, for those who say, well, why don't you eat the squirrels? Here's a video of a squirrel eating one that we just shot. And he's just really getting in there and eating the guts out. So here are the shots in the video. Um, again, I'm using the crosshairs. So enjoy, and I'll speak to you right after all the shots.
think it's him. So that's the end of the shots. Here's some pictures of the aftermath. Um, I've got a lot of pictures, but I'm not going to be repetitive and show all of them. Um, people wonder why we shoot these up there. And because these squirrels are within the alfalfa, they can't poison because this will get bailed up and then go to cattle or horses. And that can't happen. Um, you can't have poison in food for livestock. So the farmers actually depend on us, and we head up there, and they give us permission. We're very safe, and we're very careful as far as where we shoot. And the raptors love it as well. As I was sitting up there, um, I had bald eagles landing in the field, um, you know, red-tailed hawks coming down and eating the squirrels, and I just adjusted and shot in different directions while they finished that up. So basically, um, you know, if it wasn't for us, they wouldn't be able to have any crops. And here's the final shot, again, of my contender in the 17 Winchester Super Mag. And in total, I shot hundreds of squirrels while I was up there. We hunted for two and a half days. We will be heading back up in May. I will have some more reports about this area because I did some tests um, comparing the 17 Hornet with the 17 Winchester Super Magnum. And I think some people will be surprised. Again, click here to subscribe. Um, I'll have more information in the notes down below, and I would appreciate it if you like the video as well, or leave some comments. Thanks very much.